and White here for your week in review. The Crimson Tide men's basketball team leapt into the national spotlight Tuesday night with a down to the wire victory over number 12 Kentucky. The Tide led by as many as 20 points but allowed Kentucky to work their way back into the game as the clock was winding down. Still, the Tide were able to hold off the Wildcats and pull off a monumental victory for its program. Governor Robert Bentley was formally inaugurated on Monday on the Capitol steps in Montgomery. Hundreds of onlookers watched the events and the Million Dollar Band performed in the parade as part of the festivities. However, Bentley stirred controversy later in the day by stating that non-Christians were not his brothers and sisters. Creative Campus is currently accepting applications for local musicians and artists to perform in the Druid City Arts Festival. The application deadline is January 28th and is open to students and non-students. The festival will be held the weekend of March 25th in Government Plaza. Tuscaloosa residents have the chance to replace books with beer bottles this semester with a special class offered by Will Hagens. The local bar is offering Beer School where local patrons can offer $30 in return for six one-hour lessons. The classes will consist of beer tastings and special lessons about breweries and glassware. The class is limited to 50 people. Read about these stories and more in the Crimson White or at cw.ua.edu. Have a great week and roll tide.